Hello everyone. I have the house to myself today so I thought it would be the perfect time to rearrange my bookshelves. Ooh, it's going to be it's going to be a long hard slog cuz I'm moving books and stuff around. Let me show you what I plan to do. The first thing I'm going to do is move all of these down one shelf and then I'm going to put all of my Stephanie Garber books on this shelf. The next thing I'm going to do is move the shelves um, so that this will then look like that shelf over there. And then I'm going to move my DVD collection over here um, in this entertainment unit. And then I'm going to move all of these books to this shelf. Then I'm going to move all of these paperbacks to <laughs> to that shelf oh my god I, it's gonna be it's gonna be hard then I have all of these books that I'm going to move over to this shelf if I can this is my actual studio slash library and you can see it's a bit of a mess these books I'm preparing for Supernova next week so Lynette can sign them. And then on this shelf here are all my arcs and I want to move these to that little brown um, bookshelf that you saw outside. I'm not sure if it'll fit. Um, it'll be tight. So that's the plan for today. I'm not even sure if I can finish it all today but I'm going to try because I hate I hate my books being in a mess so I'll show you the finished product later. Hi I finally finished my task so if you're interested let me show you around my library. The first thing you'll see when you walk in the door which is over there is this bookshelf and on this shelf I've got my J. Kristoff on the top shelf we have um, Empire of the Vampire and then down below we've got Nevernight, The Aurora Cycles and these are all my Juniper books. Um, as you can see I've got Vid Bridgerton, um, the All Souls trilogy, um, that on the left here is Game of Thrones, Outlander and this is my Stephanie Garber um, shelves and this is all well I've only got um, one set of Caraval and the rest of them is um, Once Upon a Broken Heart and on the bottom shelf here we've got Lee Bardugo and um, these are the Lord of the Rings so that's your first shelf Over on the entertainment unit I've moved all of the books in here and put my uh, these are DV, uh, sorry, DVD TV shows and I've got some books up here and I've got some books here as well with the stenciled edges. Now these books these books here are the smaller type hardbacks um, and I thought I'd put them there and also these books are the smaller hardbacks as well. Um, I don't really have a shelf to put them in so that's where they live. And then over here we've got the second bookshelf. Um, I've put my arcs up there. I've got um, these are the smaller type hardbacks with stenciled edges. Um, and then over here we've all got we've got all the stenciled edges right down to the bottom and hi Monty and then on this bookshelf here which is where I had the DVDs I've put all my um, contemporary fiction and romances down here I've got my Nicholas Spark shelves 
and there's one more bookshelf in this room but it's really tiny let me show you over on this bookshelf which is directly opposite um, the first bookshelf I showed you are all these um, these are YA fantasies and they're the smaller type books as well um, and then over here I've got some more fantasy and then below I've got um, the contemporary fiction and thrillers now I'm going to take you through to my proper library slash studio um, it's really small room and it's really cluttered so I've got to find another space for these two trolleys because it's just so cluttered in here you guys that I can't handle it so I nearly stepped over Monty um, on this shelf I've got some YA fantasy this is my Bridget camera shelf they're all signed and personalized I think and then on this shelf I've got some you know those photo albums we get from Fairy Loot and Illumicrate so here I've got the fairy scoops on this one I've got the Illumicrate spoiler cards and this one has the A5 prints that we get from the book boxes this is my Sarah J Mass um, shelf it's not a lot I don't have a big collection over here we've got some more YA fantasy and on the bottom shelf we have um, the Lit Joy special edition book boxes that they that they released I don't think I said that right but you know they're the special edition boxes over on this shelf I've got some contemporary and YA fantasy I like to display the the edges um, and I try to keep all the colors together on this one it didn't work out because um, I wanted to keep the series together so that's why they're all multicolored and then if we go over to the opposite wall over here we've got some more um, YA uh, fantasy books from book boxes and again I like to keep the colors together these are all paperbacks by a fantasy and over here is some more books with stenciled edges and then down here is um, all these books I'm going to take to Supernova to get them signed okay and then over on the opposite wall I've got my secretary desk and because it's an antique desk um, I keep my uh, what are the classic books in here let me show you so we've got um, classic paperbacks those are just planners um, these are the special edition like you know the penguin cloth bound classics I've got my Cassandra Clare rune editions from Waterstones and my Illumicrate um, Bridgerton set and they just go in there and then over here we've got some um, Cassandra Clare paperbacks uh, YA fantasy paperbacks these two shelves down here are my Lynette Noni shelves and you can see that there are some books missing because I'm taking them to Supernova next week to get them signed and then if we go over to this side we've got um, this is my Cassandra Clare collection um, and they're a mix of Waterstones Rune Editions to um, the Book Box Special Editions. Down here is my Diana Gabaldon Special Editions. And then this little shelf here is where I had my, well these are where my arcs were and I moved them. And then I just got some paperbacks here and this is... Um, what's it called that series oh my god I can't remember you know the Kira Cass series and so now I've got these shelves that are um, empty and I think I'm going to put these 
um, book boxes on there. I don't know what I'm going to do um, yet with these, but I'll find room for them. Okay, so that's it, guys. That's my library tour. Hope you enjoyed it. And um, I hope to see you soon. Bye for now.